In this video, I'm going to show you how to hardwire in an auxiliary output into a Ford 6000 CD radio. I'm going to be putting in a Bluetooth module, but the procedure is the same whether you're putting in a USB or a mini jack port, it's the same system. So let's get into it. Okay, so now I'm on AliExpress, done a quick search for uh, Ford 6000 CD Bluetooth, and up we come, a few options. I've chosen this one, it's got the tools, which of course you're gonna need to get your radio out to work at the back of it. Um, there were some other options there for a hands-free kit for calls as well, but I just went with the uh, just the straight Bluetooth connection. Um, Four dollars fifty and two dollars thirty-eight shipping, so not bad. I think we'll get this one. It says the estimated delivery time fourteen to twenty-five days. I can wait that long. Okay, here it is, arrived today. Let's open her up and uh, see what's inside. Okay, no instructions. We've got the Bluetooth dongle and hopefully there's four keys in there removing the uh, radio from the car. One, two, three, four. And the dongle. If we look at the dongle here, we've got the unit here. We've got the uh, plug that goes into the auxiliary at the back of the radio. And our power. We've got a uh, Positive and negative because it's just DC. Right, well, let's get out there and uh, put her in. Okay, first thing I'm going to do, put the keys in. Got a flat side there, that's going to be on the out, curved on the inside. One. Two, oopsie, three, and four. And there we go, she's all out. Okay, if we look here, we'll see the serial of the radio, which you'll need if you're gonna recode when you've reinstalled it, or if that goes flat. And if you don't have uh, if you don't have it in your Ford manual or you lost your car manual. Okay, I'm going to take my keys out right now. Just so I can get confused. Just push it in from the side. Pull them out. Push it in, pull them out. Okay. Let's keep going. Put more room, put it in reverse. Okay, here we see the aerial. Just wiggle that off. Not sure what that is for. But here's our main loom here. It's pretty tight, there's not much slack in there. Squeeze that out. 
and swing it up. Okay, so the plug's held in by a cable tie, all the wires, we need to get that off. Let's just remove that and then we'll have free access to the, the cables. If you want to, you can put one in later on. I don't think it's essential. Push it gently out, the white one. And out it comes. And this is the one we're going to replace. Just push that to one side. Get our dongle now, or our Bluetooth module. Make sure it goes in the same way. The little, little dimple there that engages in that hole into the outside so we can't get it wrong. And we just gently slide that in. And it's in. Okay, now all we've got to do is connect the power and reassemble. So we need to tap into those two power wires. The red one going into this one the yellow green the black one will go into the gray green of course we don't have to put them in here we can just come further up if we've got a bit of room and find them here which we just take this tape off this bit more to play with okay here we go and we've got more room. So this one here. I'm gonna join onto our red. Join that one to our that's gonna join onto our red power. And then the big fat grey one. There it is. For the black. Okay, so these are two wires, red into that one, black into that one. Don't want these exposed wires touching anything else, shorting out. I'll probably tape them in a minute. It's going to go in there. Right. So here we go. Okay, so now we connect them up, get the black to the grey green. And when you connect them up, just make sure the end of the wire stays inside the joiner. Make sure it gets past the, the blade that's going to come down. You don't want to uh, have it exposed to other. To other parts of the car. Looks about right there. Okay, now for the red. Okay, both power wires are all done. I'm just going to put it back together. Okay. Let's put the stuff away. The Bluetooth module, I'm just going to slide down into that hole. Don't leave anything here. That's where the radio's going, and there's not room for anything else. So, connect it all back up. Just put that in. Push it so far. And push the lever at the bottom down. And it'll click into place. Antenna back on. It's a bit of a guide. Done. Okay, there we go. It's turned up BT5908. Compared to that. Yes, allow. The Bluetooth device. Is connected successfully. Thank you very much, love. Let's try it out with some sounds.
Well, that's it, job done. Not complicated, it should take you about 15 minutes. It took me a bit longer because I'm mucking around with the cameras, but anyway, I'll put the links below, AliExpress, where you can get the modules, anything else I can think of. If you need the codes, let me know. For some reason, my radio doesn't need codes when uh, I reconnect it to power, so that's good. Let me know how you get on in the comments below. Catch you next time.